bringing <laughs> possibilities, manifestations, uh, spontaneity, um, spontaneity is a very, um, powerful way to connect to, uh, or maybe connect out of, um, the controlled, uh, agenda, which our, uh, mind is restricting us within. So if we can perceive that the mind has a, an awareness which we perceive as ourselves and the mind's awareness likes to attach and fill the mind with suggestions and a lot of these suggestions are coming from other people's minds but it's all collective, you know, there is one mind, you know, the human mind. Of course, we have our own uniqueness, which comes from the uh, the infinite uh, self. But the mind has one program, you know, it's... Uh, and we might all reflect in different ways within the program, but the heart is the uh, divine self. The mind is just a control mechanism. And within this, uh, uh, you could say, reality which we are living in, uh, the mind does our best to work against the spontaneity, the, the infinite self, as a sense of control. You know, if everyone just listened to the infinite self, we wouldn't look at the world a very different way. We would look at the world as, um, well, the infinite self is is divine truth and how can we look at the world from a perspective of truth when there is so much injustice <laughs> and when we are looking from a truthful perspective we would comprehend all the injustice and within the injustice takes place all of the um the toxic vibrations or the negative milkshake which is um which is stimulating this um society you know how often are we living in a society that is um you know consumed by fear stress and worry when we're so focused on fear stress and worry we don't have any energy or don't have the point of attention to look beyond the fear stress and worry and we're just all focused on um perceiving our own problems rather than perceiving maybe um not necessarily perceiving but uh yeah you could say perceiving other people's problems or like assisting with with people how often do we not even have energy for other people because we're so caught up in our own um problems you know a lot of the time <laughs> a lot of the time and not only that is when we are caught up in a lot in our own problems we start to give our problems to other people. <laughs> and because we are, we are all, um, you know, we are all collective energy. So when we collect together, we share our energy. Even if we don't want to express our bad side, it naturally flows out of us through expressions, through even if we, you know, try and do our best, it naturally is released. So, um, yeah, but to summarise is that we started the topic about spontaneity and and um, and love and happiness and how sponte spontaneity can actually give us a different perspective from our current perspective. You know, when we're trying to understand um, why we're being controlled in the first place, being our mind. You know, we can understand that we are the essence of spontaneity. We are, we are infinite. We are divine truth, infinite possibilities. And our mind is completely giving us suggestions in life to focus on maybe one um, opportunity or one. And then what happens is, this is not a negative thing, by the way, because if we can really focus on maybe one opportunity and become infinite in that opportunity, um, then we are being true to our nature. However, 